Welcome to a video on how to get good at the Shogun Guard, perhaps the most intriguing legendary upgrade in the game. Players who are able to master this commando corn ripoff will be able to block more cheese than the number of times PopCap tried to monetize BFN. Let's get started. The Shogun Guard is the legendary upgrade for the Colonel Corn class and was the first one to be added to the game. The upgrade transforms Corn's primary weapon from a rapid fire assault weapon to a slow firing more damaging weapon that comes with a shield attachment. The weapon fires at 300 rounds per minute and has 25 ammo per clip before needing to take a 1.5 second reload. Each shot fired can deal 11.25 damage for a normal hit and 13.5 damage for a critical hit at all ranges. Because this weapon relies more on individual damage per shot it is advised that you only use this upgrade if your accuracy is above average and not on the same level as comedy plays. This also makes the weapon great for finishing off low health targets due to dealing more than twice the amount of damage per shot which may not leave them any time to react. As mentioned earlier, the upgrade also applies a shield attachment to your weapon. This shield is activated by aiming down sights and covers the top half of your body. You can also shoot whilst the shield is active and like Citroen and SB's shields, which doesn't allow them to. The shield has 75 health and regenerates at 12.5 health per second after being put away for 1 second. Because of the shield's overall fast recovery rate, it is best used to either sponge sources of chip damage or more commonly to sponge attacks that would normally be fatal to most classes, such as EPGs, Big Bang Beams, and even the infamous Brainium Basher's charge attack if you block it at the right angle, though it does not block its upper strike. It is also recommended that you try and position your lower body behind a wall so that enemies are forced to shoot at the shield. For whilst 75 extra health might not sound like much, it may be the difference between you surviving the fight and dying. In terms of strengths, the Shogun Guard is excellent for more accurate players with the high damage per shot. The shield can also come in handy in not only granting protection from potentially fatal blows but also as a semi-health extension when against high damage classes like all stars or zmex. However, its higher skill floor does make it less friendly to players whose aim is about as good as an short-sighted obese sheep with Parkinson's. The shield also cannot hold a lot on its own, and if a player knows how to deal with you, they can either just shoot your lower body or shoot the shield and then use fatal abilities to kill you. Now in terms of upgrade combinations, like every legendary upgrade are noticeably more limited given the fact that legendary upgrades ward 5 of the 7 slots leaving you with only 2 to work with. Despite this, Shogun still works well with quite a few upgrades. Mob cobs can grant extra ammo and on top of that additional damage to the shots that pierced. Given that Shogun's damage per shot is way higher than the stock corn, it can very easily overwhelm enemies. Another great upgrade would be buttered branches, which allows corn to move much faster whilst aiming down sights. This can allow you to keep your full movement speed whilst using the shield, making you way more evasive and hard to hit, whilst also blocking damage. Thanks to this guide, you will now be able to say fuck you to almost all sources of instant kills and cheese your way to victory by head glitching with the shield. Be sure to come back for the next episode next week. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more shit like this. Have fun.